Chapter 3 Introduction to Adobe Photoshop Learning Objectives Adobe Photoshop Features of Adobe Photoshop Starting Adobe Photoshop 2022 Components of Adobe Photoshop 2022 Window Create a new file Foreground and background color Selection tools Introduction When you open an internet, books or magazines, albums, brochures, etc., you may be amazed that how the images contained in them are flawless. Well, all credit goes to photo editing tools. These tools are used by various graphic designers, photographers, artists, advertising designers and web designers to create or edit images. In this chapter, we are going to discuss about one such tool, Photoshop. Adobe Photoshop Adobe Photoshop is a photo editing software which was published by Adobe Inc. for Mac OS and Windows operating systems. This software was developed by two American brothers, Thomas Knoll and John Knoll, in 1987. It was sold to the American multinational computer software company Adobe Inc. in 1988. This user-friendly and powerful graphic editor contains considerable number of tools which can be used to create, edit and manipulate the pictures. Using this tool, you can edit the digital photographs by snipping, rescaling and manipulating them. Features of Adobe Photoshop Photoshop is a raster-based graphics software where you can work on objects without losing their original quality. Using Layers Palette, you can draw or design various elements of the document independently in layers. These elements can be stacked up as per the order of display. Photoshop offers various selection tools which are easy to use. It includes Magic Wand tool, Mark Selection tool and a set of lasso tools. Properties panel of Adobe Photoshop CS6 includes Masks panel, Adjustment controls and 3D options. The layer masks create a masking portion of an object by using the grayscale color combination. Once the masking is done, the area of an object under the layer mask will get disappear. Adobe Photoshop CS6 is used to provide high DPI dots per inch displays like Retina displays, which improves the display quality. Using Content Move tool, the selected part can be moved from one location to another. Field Blur feature can be applied on a picture to give it a pragmatic, vague appearance. There is a blur gallery in Photoshop with a variety of blur effects which can be applied non-destructively as smart filters. Crop tool can be used to snip and smear the image or object by changing the size and shape of an image and also reverse it. Retouching tool includes various graphic tools like Clone Tool, Pattern Stamp Tool, Spot Healing Tool, Healing Brush Tool, Patch Tool, Red Eye Tool, etc. These tools are so much handy for graphic designers and photographers that they have brought down their manual work to simply click and drag. Adaptive Wide Angle Filter is used to straighten the objects in the images vertically or horizontally. Starting Adobe Photoshop 2022 Steps to start Adobe Photoshop 2022 are Click on Start button. A menu list appears. Select Adobe Photoshop 2022 option. The Adobe Photoshop 2022 window appears on the screen. Components of Adobe Photoshop 2022 window The various components of Adobe Photoshop 2022 window are explained below. Menu bar Menu bar appears at the top of the window which displays different menus like File, Edit, Image, Layer, View, Window, etc. It helps you to navigate through various options and use them as and when required. Options bar Options bar displays a list of options related to the tool selected in the toolbar. File name it displays the name of the file which is Untitled 1 by default. When you save your work, the name with which you have saved your file will be displayed here. Panels 
Panels are used to modify and display the properties of an image. It includes color, swatches, gradients and patterns panels. Canvas workspace. It is a blank white area where you work and edit the pictures. Toolbar. Toolbar displays a variety of tools which can be used in creating and editing pictures in Photoshop. Menu bar. File name. Options bar. Panels. Toolbar. Create a new file. Steps to create a new Photoshop file are Click on File menu. A menu list opens. Click on New option. Type the name of file in Name text box. Set the page size and orientation by specifying the values in Width and Height options. Set the resolution value in pixels in Resolution value box. Select the color mode which can be any one of RGB, CMYK, grayscale, etc. Select the background contents which can be white, background color or transparent. Click OK button. Foreground and background color. A picture is not a single colored image. It is made up of different color schemes. Photoshop facilitates different foreground and background colors with the help of which you can control this color scheme of the picture. Now the question is what is foreground color and what is background color? Foreground color. Foreground color is the main color which can be seen on the canvas when something is drawn with the help of brush tool or pencil tool. Packed file. The default color of foreground and background color options may vary in different versions of Photoshop. Background color. Background color is the color of the last layer in an image. The background color can be seen in an image when you erase it using an eraser tool. It removes any added color and replaces it with background color. To choose the foreground and background color of your choice, follow the given steps. Click on Set Foreground Color or Set Background Color Tool from Toolbar. Select the color from Color Picker dialog box. Click OK button. Selection Tools Selection tools are used to select an object. In order to perform any type of editing on an image, it is important to select it or a part of it. For this, Photoshop facilitates various selection tools. Mark Tool Mark Tool is used to select an image in rectangular, square, elliptical or single row or column which is one pixel wide. To use the Mark Tool, follow the given steps. Select Mark Tool. Click and drag the mouse on canvas to select the image or a part of image. A white dashed border will appear around the selection. Lasso Tool Lasso tool is used to make freehand selections. It contains three types of tools. Lasso tool, polygonal lasso tool and magnetic lasso tool. Lasso tool. This tool is used to make freehand selections. For this, select lasso tool. Click and drag the mouse around the image to select it. Polygonal lasso tool. This tool is used to select an image or its part in straight lines. For this, select Polygonal Lasso Tool. Click from where the selection begins. Now click at other point of the image. A straight line of selection is shown between these two points. Again, click at third point. A straight line appears between clicks. By using the same procedure, make the selection. Magnetic Lasso Tool Magnetic Lasso tool creates anchor points to the edges of the defined areas in an image to make the selection. For this, select Magnetic Lasso tool. Click and drag the mouse around the image to select it. You will notice the anchor points appearing with the selection. To end the selection, double click at the end point. Quick Selection tool Quick Selection tool is used to quickly select an image by double clicking on it. At that point, the selection is automatically expanded to the defined edges in an image. For this, select Quick Selection Tool. Press left mouse button twice quickly.
quickly over an area to select it. To add more area of an image in the selection, click left mouse button on that area and see the change in the selection. Magic Wand Tool Magic Wand Tool selects an image based on its color. When you use this tool to make a selection, pixels having the same color will be selected. For this, select the Magic Wand Tool. Click on the specific area of an image and observe the selection. Fact File To deselect an image or part of an image, press Ctrl plus D. Crop Tool Crop means cut. So, Crop Tool is used to cut the not required portions of a picture. To use this tool, follow the given steps. Select Crop Tool. Click and drag the mouse to select that part of the image which you want to keep. Double click inside the selection or press Enter key and you will get the cropped image. Drawing Tools Drawing tools are used to create drawings on the canvas. Photoshop provides different drawing tools which can be used to draw different shapes, freehand drawings. The various drawing tools are explained below. Shapes Tools To draw different shapes on the canvas, there are a variety of shapes tools in Photoshop as shown in the figure. Let us draw something using these tools on canvas. Rectangle Tool Rounded Rectangle Tool Ellipse Tool Polygon Tool Line Tool Custom Shape Tool Pencil Tool Pencil Tool is used to create freehand drawings. To use Pencil Tool, follow the given steps. Select Pencil Tool. Select the size, mode, opacity and smoothness from the option bar. Select the foreground color. Click and drag the mouse on canvas to make a drawing. Brush Tool Brush Tool is used to create freehand brush strokes just as you do with a painting brush on a drawing sheet. To use this tool, follow the given steps. Select the Brush Tool. Select the size, hardness, strokes, opacity, smoothing etc. from the option bar. Select the foreground color. Click and drag the mouse on canvas to make brush strokes. Type Tool Type tool is used to type the text on a canvas. You can type the text in two ways, horizontally and vertically. To use text tool, follow the given steps. Select horizontal type tool or vertical type tool. Click on the canvas, a cursor appears. Select the text formatting options from the option bar. Type the text. Eraser tool Eraser tool is used to erase something from the drawing. When you drag the mouse to erase the drawing, it fills the background color on the drawing. You can choose any background color with which you want to fill the erased area of the drawing. To use this tool, follow the given steps. Click on Eraser tool. Select the size and other options of an eraser as per your requirements. Choose the background color, for example, we have selected yellow color as the background color. Drag the mouse over the picture and see the effect of an eraser tool. Quick Backup Adobe Photoshop is a photo editing software which was published by Adobe Inc. for Mac OS and Windows operating systems. Photoshop is a raster-based graphics software where you can work on objects without losing their original quality. Adobe Photoshop CS6 is used to provide high DPI dots per inch displays like Retina displays which improves the display quality. Canvas is a blank white area where you work and edit the pictures. File name displays the name of the file which is untitled 1 by default. Foreground color is the main color which can be seen on the canvas when something is drawn with the help of brush tool or pencil tool. Mark tool is used to select an image in rectangular, square, elliptical or single row or column which is one pixel wide. Quick selection tool is used to quickly select an image by double clicking on it. Crop tool is used to cut the not required portions of a picture. 
Pencil tool is used to create freehand drawings.